so today I'm going to be showing you three different hairstyles which you can wear for either your homecoming, prom, social, formal, whatever you call it in whatever country. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video because I put a lot of effort into it. Also, if you're liking this makeup look, it's coming out very soon and it should be up by Saturday night. Enjoy! So first things first, I just part my hair in the middle and then I grab three sections of hair on one side, about two millimeters of width, and then I start braiding them and how I do this is I start crossing them over and each time I reach one side I add a new piece of hair and I do this all the way just past my ear and then I start plaiting it like a normal plait. And once you've reached the end of your plait, just tie it off with a small hair elastic. I'm just using my old braces elastics, which work just as well. Now I'm just going to cover my hair with my Aussie heat protection and brush it through with my fingers just because I don't want to damage my hair. After that, I'm just going to be curling my hair with my curling wand. And in case you were wondering, the hair curler which I use is the Her Styler 3P. So when my curler has heated up completely, I'm just going to be taking medium sized sections, probably about 3 centimeter sized sections, and then just wrapping the bottom half of my hair around the barrel and leaving it for about 10 seconds and then letting it go. I am only curling the bottom half of my hair because I want the curls to fall out a bit and look fairly loose. So after this, I'm just repeating the steps until my hair is curled. It took me about five minutes until I was finished, which is a reasonable amount of time, considering I am using medium pieces of hair, and I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> Now to give my hair that extra volume and make it look extra formal, I'm just going to be back combing my hair. I do this by sectioning off pieces of my hair, preferably at the back, but then I am going to be taking smaller pieces of the hair and back combing it, which you will see in a second, just like this. If you haven't back combed before, basically what you do is you take a section of your hair and then take smaller sections from that section and move your comb downwards towards your roots and this will create a knot which will create volume in your hair. It also helps if you use dry shampoo which will give you that extra volume. The final step to my first hairstyle is taking the two braids and joining them up at the back of your hair, making sure your hair still looks volumized at the top. You can tie your hair off just with another one of those smaller elastics which I showed you earlier. And this is what the first hairstyle looks like. Now for the second hairstyle, you can easily convert this from the first hairstyle I previously showed you. Basically what you do is you take your section of hair and grab it into a ponytail and then twist it through the braid and keep doing this until you reach the end of your hair. Once you've finished your bun, just secure it off with a couple of bobby pins or clips.
So for my third and final hairstyle, I'm just going to be taking my hair out of the bun and undoing the plaits. To make your bun look extra pretty, you can just use any accessories you like and I'm using this flower clip. And that's the second hairstyle complete. As you can see, the plait has made my hair look quite crimped, which we don't want because it doesn't match the rest of my hair. So I'm just going to be taking my GHD and straightening my hair until it's all completely straight. Once the front section of my hair is completely straight, I'm just going to be taking a fairly large section, just like you can see in the video, and twisting my GHD on the lower part of my hair to create a curl. Now that I've finished curling my hair, I'm just going to be spraying my sea salt spray through my hair. You guys know I love this stuff. It just breaks up my curls and makes it look a lot more natural, which I love in this look. And this is my final hairstyle. So that's it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed and got some inspiration for whatever event you're going to. Stay tuned to watch my new video which is coming out on Saturday on this makeup look and my outfit for the social. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.